Hi folks, I'm Vomba. I'm a singer and a vocal trainer and this is my channel about anatomical vocal training. Today I want to show how the contraction of the musculus gallinus is helping with the sound. Um, for instance, I'll take this one. Uh, um, without uh, using that muscle, I, I will first show you without and then I will show you with. So without is uh, nothing happens, right? I just go up and down and nothing happens. Now with this muscle, uh, uh, the sound just goes a little bit broader, right? It, it doesn't change much, it just goes a little bit broader. Same thing here. Right, I pull the voice up and while pulling it up, I try to contract these muscles so they pull to the side. Now what that does is it just makes the sound a bit wider, a bit rounder, which will help, especially when you go high, 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 to keep the voice broad and not let the, the neck uh, go inside and you're like all oh, tiny and squeaky. Um, so let's do that. Now, I don't let my thyroid cartilage go down on purpose right now, because if I would, it would be I don't want that, I just want you to hear how the sound goes broader when I just use this muscle and because I use that muscle, the, the thyroid cartilage has a tendency also to widen a tiny bit, right? It's difficult for me to not push, to pull. I don't push. I pull the thyroid down because in this height, I'm so used to just pulling the thyroid down because it makes everything so much easier. But um, you hear how the sound goes more broad, right? A tiny bit more broad. Now, I can also do that with my thyroid being down. You hear it still, it still makes a difference. It still makes a difference in the sound, no matter where my thyroid is in my throat. And that really helps with keeping the upper notes round and full even later on with the chest voice or with more um, with more head voice but very sound with very sharp sounds in head voice and therefore this is a really really helpful exercise to keep everything wide also to to keep the windpipe wide <laughs> windpipe wide <laughs> so that you don't um, you know, narrow it in and feel constricted and everything. And it's really a meditation-like exercise where you really have to calm yourself in order to really feel these little tiny muscles that you might have never felt in your life before. But it was so rewarding for me when I learned that, learned how to do it. And for my sound, I'm like, oh, I can just open it up. You know, even if I feel constricted or tight um, with like a high note, then I do this and it gets better, it gets much better. <laughs> so I hope that was some valuable input that I gave you. Subscribe and like the video if you like my content and I'll see you next time.